the sound did mean something. No problem. I will just shoot the door down. What? Why did that not work? I feel a little deflated right now. Jill? Is that you, Jill? What happened? The ceiling is coming down, and the door is stuck. Stay away from the door, Jill. I'm gonna kick this door down. Hurry! This way! That actually worked. I mean, thank you. That was too close. You were almost a Jill sandwich. Uh, what? Barry, that was a brilliant joke. I approve. But why are you here? Did you lose interest in the dining room? Uh, I just had something I wanted to check. Now, let's get back to searching for the lost captain and Chris, shall we? Wait. I have jokes, too. Yeah, yeah. You were almost a berry baguette. No? How about a berry bagel? A berry pancake? No, that does not quite work. Hey, berry? Where did he go? There are only flesh-eating dogs there. Oh, well, he should be fine with his magnum. But now I have a shotgun. Time to blow some heads. Wait, that came out wrong. Time to blow some heads. Off. That felt awfully satisfying. Another art gallery? And crows? These paintings are somehow connected. I guess these could be seen as being painted by numbers. First traps and now, puzzles? I am starting to think the zombies are the most normal part about this mansion. I will solve this. I am Jill Valentine. I am very deductive. <sighs> Luckily, I have figured it out. I need to press the buttons in reverse order. Then complete the puzzle with the end of life. <laughs> ouch, ouch, ouch. What I clearly meant was, I need to press the buttons in order. There we go, solved it on my first try. Oppressed? It might be important. I should take it with me, but I am running out of space. Maybe I can keep it under my Barret. Wait, I could have almost become a Barry Barret. Why did I not think of that joke before? It is genius. The next time I see Barry, I will tell him. But why do I even wear this stupid hat? At least they are not sunglasses. This wall looks to be covered in molt. Maybe they should have added some windows instead of puzzle and trap rooms. Now, what do we have here? An undead dog all by itself? Time for revenge. Good doggy, now play dead.
This sturdy door is locked. Even my unlocking skills are useless. Does this panel open it? How convoluted. I still need to find three more of these crests. If this does not unlock something good, I will eat my hat. This door is locked as well. I need even more keys? This place is starting to annoy me. Thankfully, I still sound calm and collected. I am Jill Valentine. I am good at keeping my nerve. Another zombie. I probably should not waste all my shotgun shells on these slow creatures. What do we have here? Another herb? Was this some sort of meth lab? Was there an accident? Do these herbs turn you into the undead? This small crammed room feels oddly safe. Earth? Herbicide? More evidence that this mansion is being used as a lab of some sort. A storage box, how convenient. Time for some inventory management. I do not need the knife. The undead do not care about stab wounds. I might need some medicine, but apparently I am still fine. Clearly, this monitor does not measure my mood. What else does this mansion hide? My, these undead are everywhere. How many people used to live here? Was this some messed up sorority house? Or have these undead been here for centuries? That would certainly explain the look of this place. I need another key? This is getting ridiculous. How am I supposed to keep track of all these locked doors? My fancy ECG monitor does not take notes. They cannot make a phone call, but all of our budget went into them. At least, according to Wesker. But apparently there was a budget for his designer sunglasses. Even more of them. I am going to run out of ammo at this rate. Another dimly lit hallway and another locked door. At least this one does not require a different key. Neither does this one, but then where are these keys? There you are. Jill! What's going on? Any clues? I have just the joke for you. Listen to this. Whoa! This hall is dangerous! Maybe it's better to secure our escape route first. There must be a back door somewhere. Let's try to find it first, shall we? 
Fine. I can take a hint. Just a moment. I found something. A sandwich? It's a weapon. It's really powerful, especially against living things. Better take it with you. What about you? I have this. Overcompensating much? It is ammo? For a weapon I do not have. Effective against living things, in a mansion full of the undead. Gee, thanks. Have fun examining the dining room, again. These stains are recent. I hope they do not belong to Chris. Now I am starting to sound like Barry too. I am Barry. I am a robot. Haha. <laughs> that was on point. Oh no. Forest? He died while overlooking a forest. I will not make another joke in poor taste. But I will promise you this. If I survive, if I need to write a report, I will not. I repeat. I will not mention that you were pecked to death by birds. While carrying a bazooka. Your secret is safe with me. So is your bazooka. I should probably let Barry know. Where did these zombies come from? Why did we not notice them before? Are they moving about this mansion? There is something on top of this statue, but I cannot reach it. Whatever. It is probably not important. Seriously, what were all these people doing here? How many rooms does this mansion have? This does not seem like a homeless shelter. And how many of these rooms are actually open? This one is locked with a password. Yeah, this place is definitely hiding something. More zombies. And more windows. I better stay prepared. Popped, just like a cork. My, it sure is bright in here. It is a nice change, but does make you wonder. Who keeps all these lights on? What happens when a light bulb breaks? How many zombies does it take to change a light bulb? None. The light bulbs in their heads have also broken. 
Good thing that no one alive was around to hear that one. Oh, my. An actual place to sleep. Now, that really is surprising. To be continued, please consider leaving a like, comment, or subscribing to the channel. Thank you.